Hello everyone. Today, we're delving into the world of a medication called carbidilol, commonly known by its brand name Coreg and Coreg CR for the extended release version. As with all our discussions, this is meant for educational purposes. If you have health-related questions or concerns, always reach out to a medical professional. Description. Carvedilol, often recognized by its brand name Coreg, or Coreg CR for the extended release version, is an oral tablet that falls under the category of beta blockers. Its primary function is to affect the heart and circulation, making it useful in treating various conditions. Initially approved by the FDA, it's primarily prescribed for heart-related issues, such as high blood pressure, congestive heart failure, and post-heart attack management. Carvedilol works by blocking certain receptors in the heart and blood vessels, which can result in a lowered heart rate and reduced strain on the heart, ultimately helping to improve its function. In the case of high blood pressure, carvedilol helps relax blood vessels, making it easier for the heart to pump blood. This, in turn, lowers blood pressure. For congestive heart failure, it can improve the heart's pumping ability, reduce the workload on the heart, and alleviate symptoms like shortness of breath and swelling. It's also prescribed for those who have had a heart attack to improve survival rates and reduce the risk of another heart attack. Warnings Carvedilol comes with its set of precautions. It's not intended for individuals who have certain heart conditions, such as severe bradycardia, slow heart rate, severe heart block, or severe liver disease. Additionally, those with asthma, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, or other breathing disorders should use carvedilol with caution due to its potential to worsen breathing problems. If you have a history of severe allergies or an allergic reaction to carvedilol, it's essential to inform your healthcare provider. Before taking this medicine, before starting carvedilol, several factors need consideration. It's crucial to inform your healthcare provider about your medical history, especially if you have a history of heart problems, liver disease, lung disease, diabetes, thyroid disorders, or if you are scheduled for surgery. If you're pregnant, planning a pregnancy, or breastfeeding, it's crucial to consult with your healthcare provider. Regular monitoring of blood pressure and heart function is advised for those prescribed carvedilol. You should not take carvedilol if you have certain heart conditions, severe liver disease, severe bradycardia, or if you are allergic to any component of the medication. Additionally, if you are taking medications that affect your heart rate, such as verapamil or diltiazem, or certain other medications like MAO inhibitors, it's essential to discuss potential interactions with your doctor. Side Effects All medications can have side effects, and carvedilol is no exception. Some individuals might experience dizziness, lightheadedness, fatigue, or even fainting, especially when standing up from a sitting or lying position. Others may notice changes in heart rate, particularly a slower heart rate. There's also a potential for digestive issues like nausea, vomiting, or diarrhea. It's essential to be aware of these potential side effects and consult your doctor if you experience any unusual symptoms. Additionally, carvedilol may cause serious side effects, including worsening heart failure, liver problems, a decrease in blood sugar levels, and certain allergic reactions. If you experience symptoms like difficulty breathing, swelling of the face, lips, tongue, or throat, rash, or severe dizziness, seek medical attention immediately. Always consult your doctor for medical advice about side effects and report any new or unusual symptoms. Interactions Carvedilol might interact with other medications. It's of utmost importance to inform your doctor about all medications, supplements, and herbal products you're currently taking to avoid any adverse interactions. Medications like clonidine, digoxin, and certain antidepressants can have interactions with carvedilol and should be used cautiously when prescribed together. Dosage Correct dosage is vital for the effectiveness of any medication. Always adhere to your doctor's recommendations when taking carvedilol. Regular monitoring and periodic checkups can help ensure the drug's efficacy and safety. The recommended starting dose of carvedilol for most adults with high blood pressure or heart failure is typically 3.125 mg twice daily. Depending on how you respond to the medication and based on your doctor's advice, this dose may be increased at regular intervals. It's crucial to follow your doctor's guidance on dosage adjustments and never alter your dosage without consulting your healthcare provider. Avoid while on carvedilol, it's advisable to avoid activities that require alertness until you know how the medication affects you. Given the potential for dizziness, it's wise to rise slowly from sitting or lying positions. 
As with many medications, it's recommended to avoid alcohol, as it can exacerbate certain side effects, particularly dizziness. FAQ Many wonder about the age restrictions for carbidilol. Currently, its safety and effectiveness in individuals younger than 18 are not well established. It's always best to consult with a healthcare provider for any specific queries related to this medication. Closing That wraps up our overview of carbidilol, commonly known as Coreg, or Coreg CR for the extended release version. Remember, this information aims to educate and should not replace professional medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any questions or concerns. Thank you for tuning in.